Hi gamers, I'm Cyber Settler and today we're playing Osiris New Dawn. Today we're um, making this um, growing, uh, uh, how it's called, growing beans, yes, to, to grow these uh, structures that are used to grow uh, food. And yeah, what you need to do is um, here you can find them in the in in the crafting um, menu uh, if you hit, hit F2. So here in the appliances, there are two type of bin: the regular bin and the smart bin. And the uh, smart bin uh, takes a circuit board and a power cell and wires to um, yeah it says that it will things will grow faster and um, yeah then grow faster than a regular bean but today we're making the regular one and they when you have this biodome they fall into these uh, like special places here right I will put one here because I need it there so you press F to confirm and just build it and then you can manage what um, you want to I think you have to be careful because depending on what you have in the inventory it will then um, take that as the thing you want to to grow which is a bit strange I don't know if they changed this but here if you if you press uh, F, B, or G, it will take whatever you have on your inventory to to grow it. So if we press F, ah, okay, yes, you're right. We require soil. So the soil, um, I find soil in. I salvaged this soil, I, I actually didn't make it. So yeah, you have to press F and then F again and it will... Uh, now uh, you have like the option to select what you, you want to plant. In this case, yes, the red berry is what we want to... Now we press B Yes, and G as well. And G, we plant the berries, and the B, we plant the berries as well. Okay, so there you are. Now we have another. I want to um, grow these red berries, and then these, like, um, how are they called? These um, fern tree berries, because with this you can make um, some juice in the in the furnace right the, this furnace is modified to cook so I can cook here and if I have let me see if I have some I think I don't have any glass container so let's um, use this one so I need a glass container. You see here, I need a glass container. I need uh, six fern tree berries and two red tree berries to make this juice. And with this, um, Yeah, I think with this I can cope with uh, with uh, hydration, right? I don't want to consume um, water for that, so I can just drink it. It's funny that it doesn't say what um, how much it it's restoring your. Ah, uh, well, for the water it doesn't say either. I thought because for the food it says it says how much it will restore your hydration and how much um, 
your nutrition value will increase and how much health you will restore but it doesn't say for the liquids so that's why i was building that okay guys but i think this is everything uh well to harvest it you you just have to get close to it and press the keys right so it's a it's a bit a strange user interface that um, requires you to press all those keys to just harvest I think um, they could improve that like using a single I don't know in this case I think they they use the F key to interact with stuff I, I think they, they they should just stick to one key to interact with everything usually it's either E or F and depending what where are you pointing at and what tool do you have in your hand then uh, it will change the what F does like here like you you will open the 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 chest and you just press F so I think that would be that would make more sense because sometimes it's also when you when you approach the bogies it's like that like you have so many options you can either if you press G, you will open inventory, F will board a vehicle, B refuel, T upgrade, and so on. And this is, well, I think it, it, it could be simpler if maybe if you point at the crates, then you, with F, you will access the, the inventory. If you point to the seat with F, you will ride the buggy and you, you get the idea, right? So that's everything for this video i hope you enjoyed and i hope to see you in the next one so this is Saber settler signing off